Welcome to Jantaburi, a seaside town in eastern Thailand with more than 300 years of history. Little did we know, Jantaburi has a lot of international heritages as it used to be an international port of Southeast Asia, trading mainly for herbs, gemstones, and rubber. Want to know more stories about Jantaburi? Please follow me. In this trip, I have my local friend, Mu, to show me around. Established since the UTI period, Jantabun is the ancient 300-year-old waterfront community located on the west side of Jantaburi River. It previously was called Ba Lum, the old community of Chinese and Vietnamese people who relocated during early Ratanagosin period. Afterwards, it was developed into an economic and commercial hub of Jantaburi during King Rama VI period. It is recommended to stroll around the area. You will find old houses and local shops whose buildings are more than 100 years old or were built around the King Rama V and King Rama VI period. The buildings are in old Thai style with wooden pattern on doors and windows. Gingerbread style buildings are mostly found here because local people have traded with Europeans. You can feel the cultural diversity in the community. I've wanted for so long to be here at Luang Rajamaitri. This is a boutique hotel, but actually it's kind of a historical place here in Jantabun community and here I am with Kunmu who is going to tour me around yeah. the hotel. Let's come with us. There are altogether 10 rooms in yeah. this boutique hotel, Long Archa Maitri, and uh, this is one of them. Each room has its own name. This one is East Asia Teak, which is a company. Uh, yes, the company to come to make a business with Long Archa Maitri. Wow, over 100 years ago. Yeah. Wow, okay, let's go inside. Wow, th this is a rabbit? Yes. Okay, so why rabbit? Uh, because the name of the poem Jan Taburi. Jan Taburi. Jan is moon. Moon, alright. Yes, and Thai people believe the uh, rabbit in the moon. When you see the full moon, moon okay. yes, you will see the picture of the rabbit. Oh, alright, oh, so that's why it's like people believe. So, rabbit! So you just told me that nowadays people still live here, so about 200 households, okay, just about almost 1,000 people living around here. And you work together to promote this place as a destination of culture, and also we preserve like many, many old buildings and turn it into like living museum, just like this one, or a boutique hotel. All right, so this place uh, belongs to Luang Rajamaitri. And who, who is Long Rasha Maitri? He is a businessman. Okay. And he is the first people to bring the rubber tea to come in the in Eastern, Eastern Thailand. Thailand. Yeah. All right. All right. How great it was to stay here in a historic place like Ba Luang Rajamaitri. This 150-year-old house has turned into a boutique hotel of 10 rooms. Not only is the place classy, but its location is also charming. At your own balcony is Jantaburi River. Yet, the best thing is the people. I feel that the team here does not only represent the hotel, but also the Jantaburi waterfront community. For me, the Cathedral of the Immaculate Conception of Jantaburi is the largest and most beautiful cathedral in Thailand. Formerly built on the west bank of the Jantaburi River in 1711 by Father Hugh Tolentino and Christian Vietnamese immigrants, the church was later relocated to the east side of the river, its current location, in 1834. 
In 1903, the old church was replaced by the present bigger Gothic-style building because of the growing Christian community in the area. During World War II, the two spires of the chapel were taken down to make it less obvious to the Allied bombers. This classic church also holds significance in terms of art. All the chapel's windows were elaborately decorated by colorful stained glasses, which have exhibited its priceless elegance for a long time. Mm, it smells so good. Yeah. What is this? This is a real home. Real home. I guess it's a, a kind of herbs, yeah. right? In Jan Taburi. All right. Over there is a tree of the real home. Oh, okay. So, so the restaurant owner they grow real home around here, yeah. and they use use for this noodle. For the noodle soup. Okay. So this is kind of a, a special dish you must try if you are in Jan Taburi. Yes. Name Kui Tiao Mu Liang. Kui Tiao Mu Liang. Mu yeah. Okay, so mu is pork. Yes. So it looks soft yeah. and tender. So it has been boiled for many hours. Yeah. All right. And this is rice rice flour noodle. Senjan. Senjan. All right. So is this the same as we same. use in Pad Thai? Yes, yes. yes. Okay. okay. Good. Hmm. The noodles are so tender. The pork is so tender as well and soft. The soup is special and it's a little sweet. The soup. Yeah. So I think the people here they love to, to the eat soup, like something sweet. Yeah, but in the, because the soup is have the pineapple. Mmm. So apart from this reo ham, they also put some pineapples yeah. to make the soup. Yeah. Also, that's why it's a little sweet. Nangpaya is the most famous viewpoint in Jantaburi. It shows a series of turns of the coastal road named Chalemburapa Sholatit, which is considered one of the most beautiful roads in Thailand. This two-way road offers a fantastic scene of the blue sea. Driving on this road is a joyful experience as well as biking. Indie stone jewelry or Ba Pai Lake Pet is probably the only place in Thailand that we can learn about the ancient way of jewelry excavation. Besides, there are fruit gardens, souvenir shop, and a nice cafe in the area. You have to book in advance for this kind of activity. There is a small fee, but kids under 15 can take part for free. The activity starts from digging some soils and stones in the puddle or a big hole underground. Then, we take the soils and stones to the pond nearby to screen for the gemstones. The whole thing might look like soils and dirt, but actually there might be some gemstones hidden. Our local guide will give some advice which one is normal stone or which one is gemstone.
Another way to screen for the gemstone is to inject water around the stones and soils until we find gemstones. The great thing is that if we find gemstones, we are allowed to take one piece home. What are you waiting for? There are still more amazing stories from Eastern Thailand. Click the links below the video to discover more. Wish you a great trip to amazing Thailand.